everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm going to try and keep this really short and sweet, yet informative. In my first Photoshop performance review, I showed you that CC 2017 really did not work very well on High 12. In the retest, I was able to fix a pen lag issue, but the stroke still had issues with random blobs and not being smooth at all. I couldn't help but try and dig further to find a complete fix since I know so many of you use Photoshop as your main art program. Eventually, I came across this optional extensions help page for Photoshop CC. It was the turn off system stylus and the turn on real time stylus that caught my attention. Turning off the system stylus forces Photoshop to use WinTab, which in theory should make strokes better since someone a while back claimed that that's what the Chawai stylus uses. However, when I had tried this, the strokes sometimes had pressure levels and sometimes didn't. Also, the strokes were shifted to the left by a centimetre or two from where the nib of the pen was and made sort of an anchor shape as well. So my next option was to try real time stylus, which forces Photoshop to use Windows Ink instead of WinTab. This made the strokes on Photoshop flawless, pressure levels worked, and the strokes were lag free and no blobbing effect. I've still got the graphics processor in the preferences turned off. I did turn it back on to see the results on how it performs. However, the strokes were still lovely and smooth but the lagging was back, so I switched the graphics processor off again. I don't mind not being able to use touch gestures because of this, as I can always reach out for my wireless keyboard instead. On the plus side, I noticed having the graphics processor off not only means you lose touch gestures, but also makes palm rejection work almost flawlessly, which meant there was no need to wear any art gloves. All this leads me to believe that maybe the High 12 uses Windows Ink rather than WinTab, which would better explain why pressure levels don't work in many older programs because WinTab is older technology, while Windows Ink is relatively new. Unless Chawai officially states something on the matter, I guess we won't know for sure. I bet you Chawai users out there want to know how to turn on the real-time stylus, and also keep in mind this may work for other tablets too, it's not just restricted to the Chawai High 12. Firstly open up a new notepad document and type in hash allow RTS, enter URTS space 1 or I've tried to make it easier for you as I've included it in the description box so you can copy and paste it. Now you'll need to save the file as psuserconfig.txt. I've also included that in the description box if you prefer to copy and paste. It needs to be saved into the Photoshop settings folder. So starting at this PC, head to Windows, then Users, then select your Windows user account which you are logged into. Mine is named Y because I couldn't be bothered deciding on an actual name when setting up Windows. Then head to App Data Folder. This may be hidden for most users. If that's the case, then you will first need to open File Explorer and go to the View tab to make sure Hidden Items is checked. Anyway, back to Notepad. Go into the App Data Folder and look for Roaming. Then the Adobe Folder, which will most likely be somewhere near the top. Then go to Adobe Photoshop CC 2017 and then finally head into the Adobe Photoshop CC 2017 settings folder and save as psuserconfig.txt. Now when you open Photoshop, drawing should feel like you're drawing on a Cintiq, except you have only 256 pressure levels and no graphic processor related features. But considering the price margins, I'm sure it's a trade off many of us will gladly accept. So this has been a fix for Photoshop CC 2017 for the Chuai High 12 and after two videos of trying to make Photoshop work, third time has definitely been the charm. I hope I don't have to revisit Photoshop for a fourth time. As always, likes, subscribes and shares are forever loved. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time. Until then, bye!